If you win against Manny Pacquiao, what's the first thing you think you're going to do? You're going to go to Disneyland? Nope. I'm going to look in the middle of the camera at HBO and tell all the critics, fuck you. <laughs> Tapos ang kanyang controversial na pagkatalo kay Timothy Brandy noong Hunyo ng taong 2012 at nang hindi inaasahang knockout loss naman kay Juan Manuel Marquez ng Disyembre ng kaparehong taon, marami sa mga boxing expert at analyst ang naniniwalang mahihirapan ng makabawi pa ang pambansang kamao dahil na rin sa dalawang sunod nitong pagkatalo. Kaya naman para patunayang hindi patapos ang karera ng natatanging 8 Division World Champion, kinasahan ni Manny Pacquiao ang delikadong laban sa batang Mexican-American fighter na si Brandon Rios. Ang buksingerong magbibigay daw uli ng knockout loss kay Manny Pacquiao at siyang magpaparatiro na raw ng tuluyan sa ating pambato. For the kill. And like I said before, one Mexican knocked him out. This Mexican American is going to retire. Isang dating WBA lightweight at Latino super lightweight champion na may tatlong pulgadang taas at walong taong mas bata kay Pacquiao. Kilala si Rio sa kanyang agresibong estilo ng pakikipaglaban, bit-bit ang maangas na ugali sa loob at labas ng ring na hindi na rin bago sa mayabang na Mexican-American fighter. Yes, the way is... Is... 2011 nang una itong maging world champion. Kasunod ang dalawang dikit na pagkatalo naman ni Manny Pacquiao kay Bradley at Marquez na ilan sa pinakapangit itong pagkatalo. Kaya naman ganoon na lang kung maliitin at insultuhin ni Brandon Rio sa pambansang kamao na para sa kanya ay hindi narutulan ng dati kong lumaban dahil sa tumatandang katawan ng ating pambato. I noticed that he's not slowing down a lot. He's not as quick as he was. He's not jumping around like he used to do. Uh, we know that he's getting cramps now. His legs are getting old. Isa pa sa nagpainit sa laban ni Manny Pacquiao at Brandon Rios ang naging segalot ng mga trainer ng dalawang buksingero na nauwi pa sa hindi pagkakaintindihan na magkabilang kampo. Balikan natin ang naging laban ng ating kababayan kontra sa American-Mexican fighter na si Brandon Rios na buksingerong magpaparitiro na Roque Pacquiao sa laban. At alamin kung paano nga ba ipinakita ng ating pambato na hindi patapos sa boxing ang isang Manny Pacquiao matapos gulpihin sa loob ng labindalawang rounds ang mayabang na si Brandon Rios. Unang bahagi ng laban halos panggigila na ni Manny Pacquiao sa suntok si Rios na tila ba gusto nang inakaut ang mayabang na Mexican-American fighter. Pero dahil sa naging maingit na si Pacquiao matapos ang pagkakamali sa kanyang muling laban kay Marquez, pipiliin muna ni Pacquiao ang unti-unting durugin ng mayabang na si Rios. Pacquiao landing the left hand more or less at will. Right down the pipe again. Rios is getting a little better at blocking the shot. But Pacquiao still too fast for Rios to see everything that's coming. Oh, good left hand. Tremendous left hand lead by Manny Pacquiao. In Pacquiao's corner, Freddie Roach told him in and out, in and out. Rios, Garcia said, I want a few more rounds like that one. Stay low. I guess he means don't take too many chances early. Which I know a guy like Michael, I mean Robert Garcia knows is that Margarita hurt Pacquiao very bad to the body in that fight. And Rios is more skillful, I think, than Margarita. Not a Brandon, I don't know. Well, maybe because Freddie Roach told him he needs an early knockout, and he wants to get an early knockout. Well, last time he told him he needed a knockout, you saw what happened. Who's is that right hand better than any southpaw I can remember? Look at that. A combination, but he always starts with the right hand. He doubled the right hand right there. And southpaws don't double the right hand. Guard where he hadn't won the first three rounds. But yes, Rios likes what he's doing. That's the fight Pacquiao needs right there. When you see that part? See that hand before right there? That's the Pacquiao you want to see. Not Pacquiao just standing right there in front of Brandon. Round 5 tuloy lang sa pagpapakawala ng mga solidong kombinasyon si Pacquiao na talaga namang yanig kung tumama kay Brandon Rios. Pero matibay talaga ang mayabang na Mexican-American fighter. At nagawa pa nga nitong asarin at hamunin si Manny Pacquiao. Para nga naman ipakitang baliwala sa kanya ang mga suntok ng ating pambato. Oh, good luck. 
Pacquiao when he scores stoppages wears his opponent down with these kind of punches. Hard left hands to the body by Pacquiao. Three of them, a left upstairs, a right left combination. Not good at stopping Manny Pacquiao from firing combinations in the middle of the ring. Who cares? <laughs> Great body shot with the left by Pacquiao. Oh. Left, right, left. Further combination. Was a major focus of training camp for Pacquiao. Good left hand to the head. To protect yourself against the body blows. Gino Rodriguez is not oh, a good shot. Yet. Oh, that hurts for the heels, I think. He reels his instinct to fight back. He reels pawing at the blood on his left eye. Catch this guy, whether or not I know where he is exactly. I'd say we're getting there. Yes. Let's say we're getting there pretty fast. Pacquiao is beginning to toy with him. Sa round 9 halos wala nang magawa si Brandon Rios sa lakas at pilis ni Manny Pacquiao na tila ba walang katapusan kung magpakawala ng suntok sa bakbakan. Halos hindi na nga rin makadepensa si Rios sa kaliwat ka ng atake ni Pacquiao na hindi man nang nakitaan ng pagbagal sa laban. Fine. Pacquiao ripping Rios with straight left hands. Well, this is the biggest hand speed deficit I think Rios has ever faced. Never fought a guy with the hand speed or a man of as, as we know, speed is power. He may never have fought anybody with the punching power of Manny Pacquiao either. Sa pagpapatuloy ng maksyong laban ni Pacquiao at Rios sa round 10, halos wala nang pinagbago sa takbo ng laban, kundi ang sumulo na lang nasuntok si Rios mula sa kamao ng ating pambato. Dito na mapagtatanto ni Rios at ng ibang panatiko ng boxing na hindi pa talaga laos ang boksingerong nakitaan raw nila na pagbagal sa pakikipaglaban. Matapos pakitaan ang isang dominanteng performance ni Manny Pacquiao, na ngayon mas mautak na akong lumaban. Very good shots. This has been the Freddy Roach pupil Pacquiao. The guy who Freddy Roach took and refined from this physical phenom to a more complete fighter. And he's, he's showing those skills against Rios tonight. He doesn't have the kind of punching thunder. Well, Brandon hasn't taken the abuse tonight that Margarito took, though. It's the slower Margarito won. Exactly. No broken bones so far. Correct. That weren't dissimilar from that. What he wants to do is hit him with the four and five punch combinations to keep it back like that. Tremendous one-two combination by Pacquiao. Actually, it was a hook and straight left hand combo. Brandon Rios' face and head are going to look like a basketball tomorrow morning. I think Pacquiao is enjoying looking at Rios' swollen, bloodied face. He is. He promised to punish Rios for the friction between the two camps that erupted into a battle in the gym the other day. He promised to show that he was the old Manny Pacquiao and that there's no reason to suggest his career is over. The crowd loves him. They're on their feet in the camp. Ang panalong ito ni Pacquiao kay Rios ang nagbigay sa ating pambansang kamao ng bakanting WBO International Welterweight title. Isang patunay na kaya pa magpakita ng isang impresibo at dominanting panalo ng isang Manny Pacquiao. Gamit ang napakatalinong estilo na pakikipaglaban. He's back, the fighting pride of the Philippines, Manny! Samantala sa kanyang post-fight interview matapos ang laban kay Pacquiao, sinabi ni Rios na hindi naman talaga siya nasaktan sa buong panahon ng kanilang bakbakan. Pero maluhalwa itong napakita ng kanyang emosyon. Matapos ang aan ni Pacquiao na magpakita ito ng tibay sa laban. Hey, oh man, it just hurts. It hurts deep down the side because I turned 